and further research. Researchers eager to design a better way of crisis to measure some concepts such as democratic values and political knowledge. Owing to the limitations of questionnaire length, three to five questions are used to measure a defined concept. Since there are only limited questions for a concept, responses to these questions matter. However, respondents sometimes provide wrong responses to these questions, such as don't know. One widely used approach to deal with the non-responses is to treat them as missing values. Treating non-responses as missing values indicate that there is no information extracted from these questions. In some cases, don't know can be considered as valid responses rather than missing values. For example, in the case of measuring political knowledge, the conventional approach is categorizing don't know into correct responses. However, more and more research suspects whether it is appropriate to treat don't know as an absence of knowledge category. This research pays attention to partial knowledge hidden within don't know. In this paper, I propose a model to extract the information from don't know responses on the one hand, and to formally test more partial knowledge within don't know. On the other hand, in specific, on combined item response theory and the shared parameter approach, which is presented in the literature on missing data mechanisms. Unlike the conventional approach, I treat don't know as missing values and assume that they are missing, not a random. The logic is that whether a response to political knowledge questions is correct or not, and whether a dominant response is provided are determined by knowledge levels. I apply the proposed model to analyze survey data from the Taiwan's election and democratization study project. In specific, I study the gender gap in political knowledge. 